hi everyone this is Ramesh from Informatica and this video is about to show you how to import the open PGP key in um, MFT console and uh, how to uh, use this key to encrypt the outbound data files to be sent to the partner so as said the agenda of the video is to show how to import the open PGP key in MFT and use it to encrypt the outbound data files to be sent to the partner the prerequisite for this demo are two things uh, you, you need to have a open PGP key from partner and second you need to have access to the MFT console because that's how you will basically import the uh, PGP key in your MFT so this demo uh, would be two part uh, first we'll import the open PGP key in MFT console and then we'll associate this certificate to the mailbox the endpoint mailbox so that any outgoing files from that particular mailbox uh, would use this certificate to encrypt the data files before sending it to the partner so let me uh, uh, show you a quick demo uh, demonstrating these steps and hopefully uh, it will make more sense things will get clearer so um, this is uh, the open PGP key which I received from the partner test underscore encrypt dot ASC I need to import this open PGP key into MFT so um, let me open MFT console and show you how do you import this key in MFT um, so this is MFT console so let me open a certificate manager you can do it by two way either you go to tools and you click on the certificate manager or you can directly click on the certificates uh, both will take you to the same screen here so um, to import the open PGP key certificate in MFT here what you do is click on the trusted CA right click here click select generate and select trusted CA certificate from open PGP key this will open a, another window which will prompt you to select the open PGP public key file click on browse and select the open PGP key which we received from the partner so in this in my case this is test underscore encrypt dot ASC click on open click on open so this will uh, open another prompt here let me give it some name so test underscore encrypt um, in organization unit let me say as informatica organization as informatica city state country as US and click on OK so now this is this step is basically is trying to import the PGP key which you received from the partner so now if you, after the import is successful you would see a you would see a certificate being added to your list of other certificates so here if I see test underscore encrypt is the one which I created and if I scroll down here below you see the algorithm for uh, open PGP key uses here encryption thing right so uh, this completes the step one which was how to import the open PGP key in MFT now second part was how do how do we associate the certificate or where do you define the certificate configure the certificate to your mailbox so that any outbound uh, mailbox uh, any outbound data files from that mailbox would get encrypted before sending it to the partner so let me show uh, let me close this one and uh, go over the second part of the demo which was to configure open PGP uh, into a mailbox so let me create a new mailbox here let me create a generic FTP FTP uh, gen generic FTP type click on clone and activate so this will create let me just name it here say test 
test underscore encrypt so here uh, you enter the server name so in this case it's uh, informatica I don't know dot informatica dot com and you define the inbox and then outbox directory so let me just create with the mailbox name itself so test underscore encrypt and uh, have the same directory as inbox for the outbox as well with subdirectory as outbox under it and I click on apply so the mailbox got created here uh, the host got created here under this there is a my mailbox right so uh, which is fine um, here a uh, few things important uh, so you have to enter the username password so let me put my username and password here for the server and uh, there is a packaging tab this is where we configure um, the packaging how the packaging has to work for this mailbox so if you once you select this packaging there's an option under that there's a partner and uh, if I click on here this is where I define how the encryption should be for this mailbox um, there are two options open PGP or XML encryption either way you can do it so this demo is mainly for the open PGP key so I'm going to select this as open PGP and then say configure click on the configure now uh, so here if you see there's an encrypt outbound and the decrypt inbound uh, since we are focusing on the encryption for the outbound files so just select this checkbox and um, here trading partner certificate so here we have to choose the certificate and this is what this would be the certificate which we just imported using the open PGP key so if I go here in the list I should find the key the certificate which I just imported which was test underscore encrypt and um, yeah and if I see here there is open PGP key information so this was the certificate so let me select this certificate and uh, for the odd mode options we have to select the armored which is 64 base 64 this certificate is not assigned so I'll uncheck this one and I'll click OK and I'll say apply so this completes the part of the configuration uh, for the mailbox associating the certificate to the mailbox for encryption so now um, I'm going to basically click on the send option considering that I have some data files under the outbound uh, under the out, outbox directory those files should, should get encrypted and sent to the partner home directory right so um, let me first check if I have the data files in the outbox directory or not alright so this is my DX instance um, this document stored is the one so let me see under the document store there's an MFT inbox under which I should have my mailbox which is test underscore encrypt so let me go there under that there is outbox so if I go and in inside outbox this directory is empty now so let me create a file here let me create a text file here so let me enter some names say John Marshall Uh, this is just a simple uh, text file I'm creating um, and uh, so the idea is this file if I say send option click on the send option in the MFT this file should get picked by the MFT and should first and in get encrypted using the PGP key before sending it to the partner 
so let's let me go to the let me get back to the MFT console and uh, click on the send option so right here I'm saying send so what it will do is it will pick the file from there and uh, I should encrypt the file okay so it's saying that the file outgoing partner has been packaged with and if you see this message here it says that the outbound data file got packaged with encrypted open PGP key and then the source file is deleted because I put put dash del star right so let me go and check if the file is now encrypted so here if I see this employee file let me do a cat of this file and now if you see this is all uh, encrypted data um, begin PJP message so whatever the data file which you just saw um, where I was trying to create the enter the name for the uh, so name of for few of the uh, few of the names in dummy file there is no more name in this file it got encrypted using this PGP key so now this is safe to be sent to the partner so um, that's it Th that pretty much what I wanted to cover during this demo um, I hope um, this is little useful for you um, if you have any feedback uh, please send it to support videos at infomarica.com or you can tweet us at twitter.com slash infosupport. Thanks for watching. Thank you.